uh, as we see PEA agreement with our city, it's uh, the slogan of PEA because PEA is uh, more or less uh, like uh, only 18% of the city. It's, uh, uh, it's uh, I mean, 80% of the territory is the city and uh, uh, all the uh, part of territory, it's part of the mountain and green fields uh, like uh, in the villages of PEA. And the Vital City and the Vital City, it's uh, mean like uh, PEA have a, a lot of uh, young people, so they are very vital and uh, they are like, uh, so this is kind of a slogan which we used also in a, a PEA development plan 2020-2028. Uh, Short facts that we have uh, from PEA here, PEA is located in Northwest Kosovo. As I said before, uh, the territory is uh, 603 kilometers and uh, only 18% of the city, it's uh, the city. Population is around 100,000 and the low altitude is 530 meters. The uh, highest one is 2,522 uh, meters, which is a uh, Gurikush or Redstone uh, in English peak uh, located in Ogova. What is uh, very interesting, uh, it's uh, because Peya it's a gate to national park of a cursed mountain. So the easy way and uh, and uh, the best way to uh, to go inside the national park is through the Peya. And also Peya is known about the water. So two like main uh, resource of the big rivers um, from Peya, the like Junibar, which continue uh, to connect uh, Kosovo with uh, Albania and also the Rivardi River, which uh, the springs uh, come from Rugova and ends in uh, Drini Bar River. Uh, uh, we, we divide the Peja as a municipality in four zones, uh, like Rugova zones, and the Peja zone, Radovci zone, and S zone. So uh, until uh, this part, it's more focused in cultural heritage. Uh, I will uh, not uh, present a lot about, uh, uh, I mean, uh, natural uh, heritage. So, Rugova uh, zone, it's uh, more focused with uh, mountain tours, rural tours, agro-tours, adventure tours, etc. cetera. Uh, Peya zone, it's more focused in cultural tourism. Uh, and uh, so here we have different, uh, we have like different uh, I mean, products of cultural tourism. We have uh, this cultural trail, which include uh, 14 uh, points in a visit. After there are different kinds of uh, events, festivals, sports and culture that's happen all, uh, all the year. La Dotsi zone, it's, uh, it's more uh, reserved for uh, environmental zone. So there is a special protection of a Gini Bar uh, uh, spring and also waterfall of Gini Bar, which is uh, one of the because also because attraction for Kosovo. And as zone, it's a, it's a reserve more for uh, education, sports and tourism zone. So there is a uh, University of Haji Zeka, there are uh, sports fields, and uh, there is also planned to build in the future like a ski center and tourism, acti other tourism activities. Now uh, we go in detail for each zone. So Goa, the status of the Goa is national park is 32,000 hectares. So uh, more or less half of uh, national park uh, accursed mountains belong to Peya. Special protected zone is the Goa Gorge, which is one of the biggest attraction in Kosovo, but it's well known also in our region and in uh, Europe. And the Gubarci zone, which is a special protection zone. Cultural and tradition, uh, there are traditional games. It's happened every year uh, it, uh, in the first weekend of August. So there are different uh, five traditional games that they play during that time. Also, uh, they do some uh, special uh, uh, dancing, mountain dancing that they have. Uh, they wear the uh, traditional clothes, etc., etc. So also they do some songs there, like traditional I mean. Also, food is very important for this region. They have this dressing, uh, spits, and most cheese, uh, which are more interesting for tourists uh, when they come in uh, to taste these uh, things. Regarding to activities in the uh, Rugova region or Rugova mountains, you can do hiking or climbing via ferrata, cycling, mountain biking, etc. Uh, etc. Et and uh, what is more also important, in 2013, uh, uh, we got the first prize in awards from 
WTTC World Tourism Travel, Travel uh, Council uh, and the best uh, uh, as the best uh, tourism tourist destination with a project Pixel the Balkan, which uh, uh, covers three countries: Kosovo, Montenegro, and Albania. And uh, as a tourist for tomorrow, for Pea, we go uh, as instead to this municipality. Only uh, territory of Pea, it's about, uh, I mean, territory of uh, city of Pea is about 20 kilometers square, 20, yes, kilometer. It's uh, for protection zone, we have old bazaar and uh, some older historical building from you know, tangible uh, heritage. Uh, tradition, there is a dress code, city old song, wedding tradition, etc. etc. Also, food, there are some traditional food that are served in different restaurants and uh, special drinks. It's Birapea, we offer that, uh, and uh, each tourist who is coming, they are very satisfied with Birapea. Activities that you can do in the city, it's city biking, cultural trail, nightlife. Some festival which are very interesting. It's Include the Park. It's uh, alternative music uh, festival, and uh, Anibar International Animation Festival. Uh, it's International Classic Guitar Festival, etc. And also we are proud that we have Mylina Mylinda Kermendi, which is the champion in Olympic champion in uh, sports of judo. And also uh, we got the prize and. Uh, as a payoff from uh, Green Corridor, from Green Belt Corridor, as an example municipality, how we need to treat and to uh, protect our uh, nature. In uh, Radovci zone, it's more, uh, we, uh, we foreseen this zone as an environment zone. Uh, the status of this zone is, uh, there is a protection, uh, natural attraction of the Drini Bar River and the waterfall of Drini Bar. Uh, what is also interesting, there is uh, one uh, beautiful cave which is open for tourists. We call Sleeping Beauty Cave, cave, and it's open for tourists, so people can go and visit also the caves uh, as a natural heritage of Peya. Uh, traditional food also. There are some restaurants uh, which offer traditional food, same uh, like uh, Rugova Park, Lechenik Pia, and you know, cheese, etc. And activity that you can do here is hiking, caving, education, uh, trail, family excursion, etc. Uh, as zone is located very close to Pea, as I uh, mentioned before, this is zone which combines from uh, three sectors: from education, sports, and tourism. So it's uh, like a distance from the city of Pea is 10, uh, 10 minutes walking and. Uh, very interesting for Pea because this zone will, uh, in the future, will uh, bring uh, more incomes of tourism here. But uh, we create like a zone near the Pea where we can control more uh, the tourists and uh, the z other zones like uh, Rugova and uh, the Radovci zone to keep more environmentally and uh, to support not to be damaged from the mass tourism. We continue in the tourism offers. So, PEA offer it's uh, based in a three level of, uh, of uh, products. So we have a local level that so we offer hiking or climbing, via Farata, cycling, mountain biking, etc., etc. What you can see here in cultural trail here in the center of the city. We have regional uh, offers with the experience of uh, region of Dugajini, which uh, include the uh, six municipality of Pea, uh, of uh, north uh, uh, west of Kosovo. And also we have a special uh, trail that we create uh, like 96 kilometer long from uh, start from Pea and in Munich. And in a cross-border level, we uh, cover like a Kosovo, Montenegro, and Albania. Uh, mainly, we have Peaks of the Balkan Trail and Via Dinarica Trail. And uh, the new trail we are developing now uh, with uh, Kosovo and Montenegro. We have uh, like 300 kilometer new trail for biking and hiking. And we start also one project uh, between Kosovo and Montenegro now to develop the culture inside these trails. This uh, project started uh, in this September, uh, in uh, September, yes, and will last uh, like uh, two years. 
so we will uh, promote a lot uh, like uh, we will be more specific in culture and we will promote uh, between Kosovo and Montenegro uh, for tourism uh, culture for tourism here you have some uh, pictures from Pea and uh, like uh, the the first one it's uh, uh, the main square of Pea the second one it's uh, some old uh, stones that are found from Illyrian uh, time and are uh, shown in the Museum of Pea. It's an uh, Orthodox monastery, Pachurkate of Pea. After it's Hamam, a part of river, a uh, park of Pea. The next uh, slide is shown more uh, this part of uh, natural heritage, which is lake of uh, in Rogova and located in 1860 meter. After some old, uh, we call it Bane, it's uh, like a shepherd house is that they go with the sheep uh, during the summer and they stay in this, um, these places and it's very traditional. Now we are starting to use this like also like a guest house where the tourists will sleep there. They will stay with families in the uh, Rogova part in the mountain and they will uh, share uh, like a conversation with the families and uh, they understand especially about the culture, tradition of Rugova and also the tourist taste, the local food that families pr uh, pr produce that will prepare for tourists. And this is, this is the uh, idea that we protect uh, uh, guest houses more than uh, over villas and hotels because we want to share exactly uh, the tradition of Rugova and Pea and uh, to be more uh, for to tourists and tourists to feel more familiar with our country. Here it's Guri Kuch, the highest peak. We see one part uh, and the green bar. The next slide, it's some activities that you can do in Pea, like uh, climbing, it's Tibetan bridge, Via Ferrata, hiking. Uh, we see this uh, house with a stone made. Uh, we have in the future we plan to protect this uh, kind of uh, houses made it from uh, local villagers and uh, to promote that as a tre treasure and heritage of Pea. Some uh, winter activities that uh, we do in Pea. Uh, regarding to statistics, okay, regarding to statistics, as we see from 2018 and 19, our statistics are fi finished, so uh, uh, we had uh, like uh, seven 75,000 eh? uh, visitors and 130,000 uh, sleeping. Uh, until 2019, we have uh, like uh, a number, it's going down about 10,000 uh, visitors. But what is good, we have a 100 and almost 50,000 uh, nights sleeping. This is uh, very important because uh, as a municipality, we are a very small uh, municipality and still uh, on the way to increasing of infrastructure. So we, uh, we don't want to have now like a massive tourism. We want more to have a small group of tourism, but to increase the number of sleeping nights. So with this number, we increase like two nights and a half uh, uh, for each tourist to staying uh, to staying here in uh, Pea. Also regarding to this year 2020 that we have this uh, COVID uh, situation, uh, the number was uh, going down. But what is uh, very good in Pea, uh, we have 60 uh, percent of uh, visitors in Pea. We have like uh, inbound tourism or uh, domestic tourism. Uh, so uh, also this year in 2020, it was a good uh, for Pea, not the uh, same that was before, but was good. So we have like uh, almost 13,000 uh, 13, uh, visitors and almost 40,000 uh, night events. So each visitor was staying like uh, uh, just two and, uh, it's say two and a half uh, night. This is more or less uh, presentation from Pea.